Well, once again, time to take a look at what's trending online. Our News at 6.30 producer, Nikki Bussey, live in the studio with the details. What are people clicking on today, Nikki? Lots of stuff, but today the top story on Google is a sad one. A Real Housewives of Beverly Hills star is mourning the loss of her ex-husband. People.com is reporting that star Taylor Armstrong's estranged husband, Russell, is dead. He was 47 years old. L.A. police tell the magazine it looks like Armstrong hanged himself, but cops say there was no suicide note. An autopsy test and toxicology test are still pending for that story. That is sad. Yeah, it's sad. Another sad one. Singer and songwriter Sarah Bareilles is speaking out about the tragic Indiana State Fair accident that killed five people. That's number five on Yahoo today. She had just finished performing when that stage collapsed. She told the New York Daily News, it felt like a bad dream. Bareilles and Sugarland have canceled their next show together. I wonder, how, I wonder how far away she was from where they, she just left yeah, the stage. She couldn't have been too far too from far where it actually from came down. Right. I, I, everything I found, she just, you know, we're praying for the families. We're, we're there Good for fun. you guys. So, yeah. Good fun. It's amazing, though. I can't believe it. Wouldn't you have nightmares about that? You know, yeah. just how close you were to that. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And for some reason today, people care about Reese Witherspoon's new tattoo. It actually made it to number two on Yahoo. I wouldn't have believed really? it if I didn't see it myself. <laughs> the pictures you see there are from a trip to Hawaii that she took this week with her hubby. And as you can see, the tad is a picture of two birds around a star. It's a no, squint. I mean, well, yeah. <laughs> no word yet on what that ink actually means. I should say that's above the bikini line. I said below the bikini line a little bit earlier, but uh, <laughs> who cares? She looks great in a bikini yeah. anyway. And she's a mom. Hot mom. Yeah, hot mom. Making the top three on Google is Elvis. Today, as we said just a minute ago, is the 34th anniversary of his death, not his birthday, which is actually January 8th. As part of Remembering the King, the city of Memphis holds Elvis Week. This is some video of people standing in line. And last night was actually the candlelight vigil, the big event where thousands of fans came together. And uh, they come from all over for this oh, week yeah. of events. And sometimes they wait for hours outside of Graceland just to be a part of it. And still, they still make millions of dollars every year. His fans are so loyal. Yeah. I was coming home from high school football practice <laughs> in 1977 when I heard You're the kidding. news over the radio oh. at the time. I can still remember that. That's one of those things when you remember exactly where you were when you heard what the news. What was going on, right? And that's, that's exactly where I was, coming home from football practice. Wow. Now, you're from Memphis, right. so you've probably seen all that chaos oh, yeah. around this time. It's It gets intense, but in a good way. It's like the city comes together for this loving week of remembering Elvis mm -hmm. and restaurants bring out Elvis's favorite dishes. Oh, and yeah. cool. and I was telling Michelle earlier that the, the weather is really good this year because in years past, people have passed out in line, like Ooh. waiting to see, you know, get to Graceland. But they've been lucky this year, and it's been nice and Cool sailing all the People way. People still love Elvis. He has love fans him. of all ages. Yeah. I've been to Graceland. It was mm -hmm. fun. Really? It's, yeah. That's one place I have never been. I'm looking forward I to it. It was a little weird because yeah. I expected this huge mansion. Mansions back then are different than the men, mm -hmm. you know, mm -hmm. the cribs you see today. You know, yeah. the <laughs> but it was it was really. And it was stylish yeah. then, but it's a little hokey now. With <laughs> the way you decorate it. Green People carpet on the wall it. or something. Oh yeah. yeah. But it's it's neat. All right. Yeah, thank you, Nick. A couple of celebrity birthdays today. Madonna, 53. Halle Berry, 45 what? today. They're so young, I think, looking. Ah. Yeah, good for them. 45 uh, is young. <laughs> <laughs> Some much lower temperatures are in the forecast. Meteorologist Rob Ellis will explain. Stay with us. <laughs>